Oh, he's coming, he's coming. Oh my gosh! Yo guys, okay, so this right here is my Dolicothele Diametanensis and down there is my Cyrocosmus elegans, also known as the Heartbutt Tarantula. But look at what's on the Heartbutt Tarantula's enclosure. Look at that! We have a little jumping spider, just chilling. So let's try to feed him a roach because why not, right? I'm so bored today, I have nothing to do. So let's get a small roach and see if he will take it down for us. If he does, then... Yo, that'll be awesome, man. That'll be sick. All right, so let me get this container over here. Put in some roaches right there. Yeah, we've got some good-sized ones. Oh my gosh, what are you doing there? Dude, get get back. Oh, no! <laughs> Whatever. All right, we've got good-sized ones here. Let's get the tong and let's feed the little guy. Hopefully, he'll give us a nice jump down, takedown. Because if he does, then yo, that's going to be sick. All right, so sorry if you guys can't see. But let me just get this little one over here. Let's get a, get him back. No, 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 no. All right, there we go. All right, let's put the roach there. All right, let's see if he'll take it down. You want it, dude? Oh, he saw it. This looks good. This looks promising. Come on, little dude. You got this. Get the roach. Oh, he's coming. He's coming. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yo, yo, we just fed a jumping spider. Oh my freaking god. That is so cool. Look at that. You're welcome, little dude. I don't know how long since this guy has eaten, but yo that is awesome dude you're welcome oh my gosh man I, if you guys remember i actually did post a video on me feeding a jumping spider but that one i gave it like a huge turkey stand roach and if you guys remember that takedown yo that takedown was epic because the roach was huge and the huntsman and not no 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 huntsman the jumping spider was not that big but this guy uh unfortunately this guy over here is still pretty small because as you can see that's the size compared I'm literally right beside him. You see? Yep, that's the comparison of him to my finger. But yeah, that is awesome. Look at that, man. You're welcome. Yeah, so this one is way smaller than the previous one that we fed. But I think this one, yep, yeah, the takedown is pretty good as well. You know what? I think I'm going to do a future video on me just going all around the places, bring a whole bunch of Turkestan roaches and just feeding them one by one. I think that's going to be an awesome video, man. I really cannot wait for that. Yo, I think I'm going to do that. But as for now, yo, I think I'll put this guy feeding in slow-mo like right now. Yep, definitely awesome, man. <laughs> slow-mo never fails and these jumping spiders they never fail now this guy was just pretty much just chilling up here looking for food yo the roach is already gone man he's gone look at that sorry if this isn't as clear as it should be but yeah there we go it's oh and the roach is still alive by the way yeah you know what we're doing this little guy a favor because he's he's living in my room helping me with getting rid of all the mosquitoes and also i mean why not give him a nice treat right since he is just chilling here hmm yeah oh yeah by the way i did get a what do you call this a matured male tarantula from my friend and we are going to be pairing him with my female over here i'm not sure there she is there's my female down there so let me see if she'll go in hopefully she doesn't go okay good 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 all right so there is my female and she is massive compared to the male let me give you guys a quick look at the male and yeah you guys can see the reason he put it in plastic is because the container he's in has a hole so yeah that's unfortunate but let's let's just take this oh my gosh hopefully you don't bite me yo the male is super small yeah you can see there's the hole right there but let me just get this thing out and hopefully he doesn't bolt out on me it is a small little matured male compared to my female yo this is gonna be pretty interesting man the female is literally like i don't know maybe three times his size yeah look at the size comparison of her legs right there i'm not sure if you can see and look at this guy he is absolutely tiny <sighs> I hope that this guy doesn't get eaten. Now, a lot of you guys did mention in previous videos where the male, the mature male was eaten because he was small and the female was big. That tells me that a lot of people are not exactly sure about tarantula breeding. Now, males, when they are mature, they will, I mean, you guys probably know, some of them will have tibial hooks. I'm not sure if this one has, but yeah. They have tibial hooks and those big punching pedipelts. Yep, they look like little boxing gloves. So yeah, once the male 
male already has those, that's pretty much it. He's not gonna grow any bigger. Yo, you are not coming out of that hole, man. You are staying in. You know what? I think I will put it back into this little plastic bag. I mean, he is an old world and I do not want to risk him bolting out on me. That'll not be good. But yeah, guys, as I was saying, males, once they mature out, they will have those hooks or those pedipal punching bags. I mean, no, punching gloves thingies. They'll not grow anymore. That's pretty much their ultimate mold. But there are occasions where males, they mold again like one last time after they mature out. But that is kind of rare based on my experience. However, mature males, if you go and search a lot of breeding videos, I mean, it of course, it depends on the species. But for this species, it is small. And for those tarantula guys, you guys already know that is a matured male. I know my female is big. She is about five to six inches and the male is about three inches. However, yeah, like I mentioned, that's pretty much how big the male is going to get and he's not going to get any bigger in the wild. They do breed like that because matured males for tarantulas, they are fully grown and fully capable to breed. They're not going to get any bigger and even if they do get bigger, it, I mean, it's not going to guarantee that they're not going to get eaten by the female. That's even if they even get bigger, but usually no. Mature males, once they have matured out, then that is pretty much it for them. They've only got a few months depending on species. Some species have maybe one or two more years extra to live. But in general, mature males, especially baboons, they only have a few months to live after they mature out and they're gonna breed. A lot of baboons also, the males are way, 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 way tinier than the females. And that's just how nature intended it to be. And it's just how they are. So nope, guys, for those who are wondering, no, I am not breeding a small male to a female. The male is, that's pretty much the biggest it's going to get so yeah we'll do the breeding in another video but as for now this video is not even about this i mean now when i look at the the time me explaining about this mill is even longer than what this video is supposed to be about yeah this video is supposed to be about this little dude over here this little cute guy look at him he's really enjoying his roach and the roach is pretty much all gone he's all dead so yeah, I guess. <laughs> See, I got carried away from one thing to another, but you know, it happened. So I guess that'll be it for this video. I just wanted to show you guys, mainly I wanted to show you guys the how the small little dude takes down a roach. And I was really hoping that he would eat, which is awesome. Hopefully I'll be able to do the uh, future video, the one like I mentioned, the one that I will go out and search for all the jumping spiders and just feed them one by one. That'll be sick, man. Hope you guys would love that video. I'm pretty sure you guys would. Comment down below if you like that. So yeah, guys, that'll be it for this video. Just a short one. I mean, it's almost, yeah, it's quite long, actually. <laughs> I thought this video was only going to be like three minutes because I was just going to explain to you and show you guys the jumping spider. However, nah, man, I just got carried away as usual. So guys, that'll be it for this video. Make sure you like it if you did. Thumbs it down if you didn't. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Stay safe. As always, peace.